in the north in the region of Punjab there is Rupar Rupar in the foothills of the Himalayas and this is the farthest outpost in India in the north similarly there is another important site another important site called Manda Manda in Jammu and Kashmir you see the Indus civilization was essentially a culture of the plains reaching but never really crossing the sub Himalayan foothills in the west the civilization penetrated to Baluchistan up to Sukta Gendor close to Pakistan's border with Iran so this is the extent the entire extent of the Indus civilization and on the whole it can be said that in terms of modern territorial boundaries the civilization covered almost most almost the whole of Punjab almost the whole of Punjab uh, Punjab falling in both Indian Union as well as in Pakistan apart from this it included Haryana parts of Western UP Northern Rajasthan Sindh most of Gujarat and parts of Northeast and Southern Baluchistan so you get some idea about the spatial spread of the Indus civilization all these states that we know today fall within India and Pakistan were under the Indus culture names do have some significance but often the first names may not be suitable which have to be modified with later findings some call it Harappan civilization some call it Indus civilization and yet others call it Indus Valley civilization what is it finally it was called the Harappan civilization simply because Harappa was the first site to be excavated by Dairam Sani right Harappa was the first site in the Indus civilization to be excavated by Dairam Sani and hence by that uh, uh, what shall I say uh, by that logic uh, the entire culture came to be called the Harappan culture because there is an unwritten um, uh, unwritten understanding among the scholars and historians there is a tradition that usually uh, uh, civilization is designated by the earliest site by the first site that has been discovered so it is simply that just because Harappa was the first site to be excavated by the archaeologists that name stuck it continued to be called the Harappan civilization and who was the person who first used the term Harappan civilization it was Mortimer Vila right it was Mortimer Vila who first used the term Harappan culture in his report on the excavations of Harappa way back in 1946 just one year before independence in 1946 but listen to this even then just seven years later that is in 1953 Mortimer Vila also used the term Indus civilization right so he began by calling it the Harappan civilization then he himself called it the Indus civilization in 1953 uh, when he published a book on the subject and the title of the book was Indus civilization so you see nothing was yet fixed then right as it is now also